today my recipe is making eggplant with egg. It's like um, pancake eggplant. It's a Filipino dish, so I'm gonna use. I boiled the eggplant already for like 10 minutes, and I'm gonna use the some of my tomato that I used it earlier um, for my um, breakfast and. The reason why it's like that because I removed the seed and it was there for my seedlings. So now I'm gonna use tomato and um, onions and two eggs for this. So how fuck guys? I'm gonna chop. So guys, I'll chop the eggplant like a small square This um, recipe is good if you guys are vegetarian. You can like, you have an option not to put the eggs and just saute with the garlic, tomatoes and onions. But if you would prefer to be like more tastier, just mix it, mix it with eggs. But because of my husband loves this one with eggs, so I'm going to put some eggs later on. And yeah, guys, see you. By the way, for the sauce, you could either use some... Um, dark soy sauce don't put uh, salt and just use dark soy sauce and make it like a salad salad eggplant salad with um tomato as well um and onions and a little bit of vinegar then you can have your own salad and you can chop some cilantro with it and that would be a great food for like any day. You can have it for breakfast, lunch, or dinner. This one will be our dinner. And it will. I used two eggplants, by the way. I mean, three eggplants, by the way. I'm sorry. And it's so much. So you can just use one or two if you're, you know, um, eating by yourself. You can have it. You can grab some two eggplants, boil it, and chop it really small. Um, and chop some tomatoes, onions, and cilantro. gonna put the eggplant here in, in our bowl and of course we're gonna chop our tomatoes I'm gonna use um, mm -hmm. Not all of this. Maybe that's a good one. That's much tomatoes I'm gonna use today. So I'm gonna chop my tomatoes now.
if you notice I am a left-handed I'm holding my knife on my left hand and yeah most people are I think right prefer to use the right hand but since I was young I'm using my left in everything I do so guys it is chopped already I'm gonna mix it with my eggplant right there so now it's about time to chop an onion like half onion that will, will be great so I'm gonna wash it peel it just like that one guys I prefer to remove one more skin on there and kind of clean it see let's chop it As you can see I did not chop my onions finely but I think that's fine you can you know, chop it your ingredients finely if you want it but um, I would rather to have like a crunchiness on my tomato pancake so there you go guys and now we're, go we're going to my garden to cut some to grab some spring onions see it's raining so i'm going to grab some spring onions i will not use that one because that one is a leeks so i don't want it so you can see my garden now but um oh had my surgery so I'm being careful down here I'm gonna go there to grab some spring onions guys I'm being careful to bend myself there you go now um, I'd rather to grab one maybe um, sorry for me to bend guys maybe um I'm just gonna cut it. Maybe that would be enough. Guys, I cut it. There you go, guys. I only got some. Uh, wash my spring onions now. Let's cut this. Easy. It's fresh, it's organic, it's awesome. So you guys, I suggest you better like plants, vegetables in your backyard or start doing a raised bed so you can have your own fresh organic vegetable. I have onions there, ginger tomatoes, garlic in my backyard. As you can see, my cabbage and carrots. We're gonna do, we're gonna harvest our carrots soon in our cabbage, so watch out that one, guys. I'll show it to you. This was onions just chopped. Mix it in everything in here. By the way, it's just like this. You can add salt and pepper if you want. And a little bit of vinegar. And um, olive oil. It will be a great salad, you guys. Yep. And then I'm just going to mix it with my hand. Because, you know, 
my hand is clean to kind of squeeze everything and I'm gonna grab some pepper and salt so guys I'm gonna use a little bit of salt and pepper that's fine And mix it. I just finished mix, mix the salt and pepper. I grab two eggs to put it here. One, two. Guys, I'm going to put some oil just wait it until it's ready. Okay, thank you. So guys, it's ready. So I'm just going to pour everything there. Just one big pancake. I'm sorry you guys. By the way, sneeze far away from the food. Okay. So guys, uh, make sure uh, you don't have to overcook it's a, because the eggplant is already cooked. I boiled it before I chopped it. So it will be easy. And yeah, we'll see where it goes. We'll see you guys. We'll try. Mmm. Yummy. 